Here we have a post incunable. This is the oldest book I own by far. And I'll be curious to see in the future if I, if I own a book older, any older. This is from the year 1515. Check this out. This is mind boggling just as a historical relic. I mean, look at this. Someone drew a castle. I'm trying to research what castle this could possibly be. There's various databases online of castles. It's a, it's a long shot, but it's a rainy day project. This is by Lactantius, a Christian author of the year, this is the, the 4th century CE, after, so like, the, like year 300 after the death of Christ. Opera means work in Latin. 1515. This is vellum. So, post-incunable is an old book. So, what is what is a post-incunable? Well, according to Wikipedia, post-incunable, period marks a time of development during which the printed book evolved fully as a mature artifact with a standard format. So, basically, before the year 1500, books were called incunable, incunables. And they were an early version of our modern book they maybe lacked formats in the construction as far as the the way the book's laid out inside it lacks things that modern readers would recognize so the formats weren't worked out yet and it's kind of like at this arbitrary date the year 1500 but i'm sure historians came to that date after studying many 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 books and then you know they have to pick a date i get it so there's a small now post incunables are curious because it's a small window of time According to the to the UK format, it's post incunables are from the books printed from the year fifteen oh one to fifteen twenty. That's like a nineteen year window. That's extremely small, narrow window. And in the rest of Europe, defines a post incunable as a book printed between the year fifteen oh one and fifteen forty. So it's still a very narrow window of time. It's quite amazing. So this book, what is this book? This is a post incunable. It's entitled. It's in Latin, by the way. This is all Latin. It's entitled uh, Divinium Institutionum by Lact uh, Lactantius. Again, a 4th century Christian author. It discusses the... It, it, it discusses pagan beliefs versus Christian Christian beliefs. Now, this book uh, it has a few, a few pages missing, so there's a few facsimiles. That doesn't bug me at all. Now, what's really enticing, and I've read a little, I've, I've, thanks to Google Lens, I've translated some of this, and just, I've just like a page or two. This is going to require a lot of time, and right now I'm, I'm, I'm working on a lot of projects. But from just to share with you all what I've read, like one paragraph talks about this is a, this book, this book was written during the year three, around the year three, uh, between three hundred three and three eleven CE. And it talks about this is a time when there's few good books and few male teachers available. Now, it said male. I thought that was kind of curious. Um, but it reflects the period when who was educated in the year 300. And it reflects the fact that books were so important. But there's a lot more to read. Now, check this out, though. The, the interesting thing in this book is there's some handwritten notes that are quite ornate. I'm going to find... It's in great condition, too, by the way, for being from the year 1515. Check this out. Looks like Benjamin. Now, this is the time during Da Vinci, so how cool would that be if this is this was printed in Venice in the year 1515? I believe Da Vinci died a few years later, so who knows? I need to do research on these on this, hand, this notation because there's a, a decent amount of it towards the end of the book. It's quite beautiful and quite intriguing. Look at this. This is written in the year 1515. What did the person do after they wrote these notes? Fetch some water from the, from the well with a, with a piggin? 1515. This is a gorgeous post incunable. Again, the, f the first few pages are facsimile, but that's okay. For being that old, it works. Some other handwritten notes. Amazing historical document. This is the year 1515, post-incunable.